This short tutorial will show you how to use TDO uh, for patient communication and education. Historically, we've had an education module in TDO that has some features that allow you to talk with the patient. And we have not developed this module very much because the draw page and communication page is so much better for that. To go to that, you go to case presentation, open the draw page, it posts the uh, pre-op 1 x-ray here and you have a side panel uh, to the right that allows you to bring in diagrams. Now usually you just pick one of the drawing tools, pick your color and go ahead and draw for the patient either here on the uh, canvas or you can also draw uh, on the radiograph itself but occasionally you'll actually want to have a predefined drawing and those are located right here where your predefined drawings are and TDO comes with a series of these which you can load and this is a very powerful way to communicate with the patient and when you click over on the right you can load um, another diagram from your predefined drawings. So it's worthwhile spending some time getting comfortable with these. Every time you click on a box and come to your predefined um, drawing, you can uh, load the diagrams that you have. And you can add to your library here very simply. For example, let's say um, we have, we're doing a case and we have a, we want to add to a, a, a predefined diagram another case to show the mesial buccal root. Well what you would do is double click on the right. When you double click the image organizer will come up and let's say you've saved some cases that you want to use in your library for example or in your lectures. I have a, a lecture series of mine in Dave Rosenberg's cases and you go and you, you scroll through and you find one that you want to actually put in your predefined di diagrams. You double click it, you load it, and then you actually save that. Save as, let's just call it uh, MB Anatomy 2. As soon as that's saved, it is now in your list. Here it has been saved. So you can add uh, new examples as you use the program. You'll develop um, more predefined diagrams that you use in a patient education uh, setting uh, that's far and above better than what was in TDO before with uh, just these, e these brief education uh, pictures. So you can create uh, a very sophisticated uh, patient presentation series. For example, you can see there's nothing in here um, about fractures. So let's say I wanted to add, uh, we all have to talk to patients uh, about fractures. So what I would do is double click, it brings up um, the image organizer. I go to my library because I know I've saved some things with fractures. Um, Here's a fracture picture. I double click on it. It loads the fracture picture and now I'm going to save that fracture picture say as fracture 1. Now I have this uh, not only for this patient but for every single patient uh, that I need to give a case presentation to. Um, that is now in my a predefined drawings library and this can be an infinite library but we recommend that you keep it relatively um, compact so you don't have to spend a lot of time uh, searching but all of these diagrams that you have in predefined drawings can make your case presentations really really powerful.